what is the church? What's the church about? What's it, what's it supposed to be doing? And what is its function? Uh, these are questions that are important for us to know if we're going to be a fully functioning, healthy follower, disciple of Jesus Christ. We need to know how to function in the church and what's supposed to be taking place. And this is part of a series of videos on our channel, Bethel Pittsburgh's YouTube channel on their playlist called The Disciple. How do I become a strong disciple of Christ and how do I disciple others? In Ephesians 4, there are four primary categories towards pursuit of spiritual growth. One of those categories is the pursuit of doing service of ministry. And that fits under the context of understanding what the church is and what the church is supposed to do and what it, its mission is. Uh, just a side note, the church is any, any follower of Christ is a part of the church, uh, at least organically, and has a responsibility to serve the church and the mission. Well, what is the mission? Matthew 28, 18 through 20, Jesus said, uh, go and make disciples. So the the thrust, the mission of the church is to make disciples. Now, what is that? Go and make disciples, baptizing them in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Uh, so it involves leading people towards a commitment to Christ connected to baptism and water. And then it, he continues teaching them to observe all that I have commanded you, and I am with you always, even to the end of the age, in, implying that this was a... a a mission that was given throughout all human history. And the discipleship piece is teaching someone how to obey the Lord, teaching someone how to surrender to Jesus Christ and, and how to live their life out for Jesus Christ. So it involves uh, teaching them all the ins and outs of how to follow Jesus Christ. And so that's, that's the purpose of the church. Now, there might be different things that the church does to try to gain people, uh, gain a platform of people. So social events, um, different types of outreaches and community connection and things like that, relationship building things uh, might go in that direction. But the purpose really should be. Now, this might not be the case for all churches, but the church is, the, the purpose should be to gain a platform with people, to persuade them to commit their life to Christ, and then to show them how to live out that commitment to Christ, which ultimately will result in them also making disciples as well. So Sunday morning, the preaching should be geared towards instructing people on how to follow Jesus. And unfortunately, today, in our culture, we kind of have this idea that the pastor's role is to make me feel good, make me feel better. And it can contain some of that, but really the pastor's role is to, is to help people learn how to follow Jesus Christ, to live their life for Jesus Christ. And not only that, but it's not only the pastor's role to make disciples. All of us are called to make disciples. So if you are a part of a church, then you should not, we, should, we should not resist the movement of the church if it's not, if it's not uh, countering the, the mission. So things like the decor of a building shouldn't be such hot button issues. Uh, the furniture in the building, who's in charge, um, what, what our view is on very s numerous secondary issues, um, what program exists and how, unless it is related to the mission, unless it affects our ability to make disciples, then that should not be an issue. The issue should be, when we, this is where we should be encouraging the leadership of our church, supporting the leadership of the church, serving the leadership of the church in the direction of how do we get more people and how do we make them disciples? How do we show them, persuade them to follow Christ and how do, how do we show them how to follow Christ? And, and so the instruction, and that's in, in part the reason for this series, is to teach someone how to follow Christ uh, what, are, what are the right views of the world in my life? And then how do I live that out? 
And that's what the church should be doing, is making disciples. And so I encourage you to, to support the church in that and help the church be that. If you're part of a church that's not doing that, then try to, try to change the, the direction uh, while respecting and submitting to leadership. And if that doesn't work out, then, then find a church that aligns with the mission to go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, teaching them to observe all that I've commanded you, and lo, I am with you always to the end of the age. Are you making disciples? Are you helping your church make disciples? That's what we need to do. That's the mission. Uh, if you have any questions on that, uh, just leave those in the comments below. Um, if you live in the Pittsburgh area and you would like to grow in your faith in person, you're welcome to join us anytime, Sundays at 10 a.m., Wednesdays at 6.30 at 2501 Staten Street, Bethel Assembly of God. God bless.